Hello. Hello, hello. If you're wondering, I'm not doing a Dilophosaurus showcase, considering that uh, Matt already did one, and I don't feel like I can uh, further explain anything. Uh, so there's no need. Uh, but I literally just finished working on the uh, on adding the Triceratops. Aiden just finished animations as well, so... Yeah, let's just get going. I'll spawn as the baby here. You can see um, it doesn't have growth or age deformation yet. Uh, meaning that, for example, the baby doesn't have shorter horns. Um, but we actually do are planning on uh, on doing those edits eventually. Um, so you'll, you'll just have to wait for those. Um, but to start off here with the, uh, the baby animations, you can see... Uh, the baby's kind of cool. The model is cool, just in general. Um, and look at this. Okay, so I made sure that the baby is a lot faster than the adult uh, compared to size. We've got a a gallop for the baby. You can see the baby is definitely not slow uh, when running around. We also fixed a lot of stuff uh, since my last showcase. For example, the head turning is a lot smoother now. You can see the Instead of just being one part that's moving, it's every single neck part and every single fake head part. Um, which is very nice um, for general purposes because it just looks more smooth. Plus it can also blink. Uh, it looks a bit goofy on the baby because uh, the parts do not like to get that small on the baby. So yeah, it, it just looks a bit strange. Let me just uh, get away from Aiden. But you can see uh, my animation should change now. Now I'm now I'm using the, basically the adult animations, and you can see I get a bit into the ground. Not too good, not too good. So let me just make me myself adult here, so you can see. So adult triceratops. You can see I'm a lot bigger than the baby. Um, let me make Aiden fully fully baby mode, so you can see the size difference. Like you can see, this is a baby triceratops, and I am adult triceratops. It's pretty cool. Well, the whole game is experiencing issues right now. Uh, but we do have a fix for that. Actually, um, I do plan on actually opening this, uh, this version of the game for a stress test, like, in a moment, to see if it's less laggy for people. But uh, I, I'm gonna showcase the Triceratops, etc. first. Um, let me make myself Elder so you can see the Elder stats, etc. Alright, so I'm Elder now. You can see I have a lot of HP. I also actually changed the, uh, the HP for the Triceratops. Let me show you in the, uh, in the menu, the stats. The collision lag is a strange thing because uh, we, we enabled a new feature, which uh, basically fixed it. We tried to like five different dinosaurs that was no collision lag at all. Then we tried it again the day after and noticed that sometimes the collision lag was still there. But it is random every single time you spawn if there's collision lag or not, which is really strange. Anyways, you can see the Triceratops stats right here. Um, so what we did was we buffed the HP by 40 as the only thing and then we nerfed the run speed of the Triceratops. So before the Triceratops ran with a run speed of 21, now it's 19. So Triceratops can no longer, for example, catch up to um, Tyrannosaurus Rex. Um, and yeah, we've also changed it to uh, spawn in the jungle. And its favorite food is the jungle food. The animations were not finished in one day. They were finished uh, within two days. So... But yeah, Triceratops spawns in the jungle now. It's pretty cool. Um, we buffed it a bit, but nerfed the speed. So basically the only thing it can outrun is uh, Shantungusaurus. Any carnivore can catch Triceratops, but Triceratops will most possibly beat every single carnivore, except for maybe the hybrids or something. I don't, I'm not sure. Maybe JP3 or Albino Giga. I am not sure. Don't quote me on that. 
Uh, there's no skins for it right now. And I am unsure if we're going to get a garden skin for this update. Maybe we're doing a mini update with the garden skin uh, later on. Uh, the same thing for the parasaur because I don't think we have time for that. Also, another thing. Um, I have decided to uh, scrap the Sarko uh, for tomorrow. It's like the model was not even done, uh, which was a bit annoying. Uh, it was meant to be done Wednesday, but it's not done yet. So we, we can't animate a model in four hours or something. So it's going to... The, the Sarko's either going to come during the weekend or we're uh, making it next update. Um, but we'll, we'll have to see what we do there. Uh, I won't promise anything. Anyways, I'm going to spawn in as Triceratops again. I want to show you the... Uh, the rest of the animations. Let me just turn off this music so you can actually can hear what the heck is going on. Let me just get some volume up in here. You can see the blinking. Let me just uh, whoop, right there. Look at that. Whoop! It popped up right there. You can see the big shunker. Let me do the uh, the roars. So let's start with the aggressive roar. That was a bit delayed. Let me let me try again in a moment. This is the friendly roar. And we got the broadcast. Let me do the aggressive one again, please. Oh, here it just got it. It just has to load. Dude. Just wait a minute. There we go. That worked. And we got the scent. Uh, we got it there. Yeah, it just sends basically. Um, you can see the uh, boreal food is. It was actually never the boreal food that was the uh, nutrition of trike. Um, but yeah, it's it's the jungle now. So even if I eat this uh, food, I'm not getting any nutrition. This skin also, I don't know if we're using this as a default yet. Uh, but it sure looks very beautiful. This skin. Um. It's, it's really up to Bripo if we're uh, using this for the default skin. Jacob Kimba has already said, Trike is going to be a lot slower. So even if they KOS, you could just run away from them. Even as T-Rex, you can outrun it. Obviously, a level 0 T-Rex cannot outrun a level 60 Elder Triceratops still. So we're talking uh, base stats. So it really depends if, if your tier is level 0 and just mature and an Elder try comes that is level 60, nutrition, etc. Then you will most likely die. Um, so it's it's both, both buffed and nerfed. So it's basically just the same as before overall Triceratops. You can also see this is the running animation for the adult. It's actually not even a gallop. It's just a, a fast run, I guess. Fast walk. I don't know what to call this, but it actually uh, turned out pretty good. I had to speed the animation up a bit because, yeah. Try a bit uh, cool. Yasako is still in Blender. It's not even in Roblox yet. So that's why I got to delay it. Like, there, I'm not releasing Sako while, like, it, it just came out and we just gave it some poo-poo animations. We need a bit of time to make the animations for it so it looks cool. Um, so Sarko will either come out in the next update or maybe on Sunday. It depends. Um, I got a really big assignment at school, um, the next two weeks. So I'm not sure if I can have that much time for all kinds of random things, but I'll make sure to, um, to put some time into this as well. Obviously. Um, then we also did something, uh, something else. We also added trotting. We just uh, play the walk animation. If you press X, we actually haven't added it to mobile yet, so we gotta do that tomorrow. But if you press X, you begin trotting. You can see I just began trotting right there. Basically, trotting just uses the walk animation, but makes it faster and gives you faster speed. So you can see I'm now faster. Um, and the only downside to this is that you don't regain any stamina when you're trotting. Um, this is obviously what it's like for Triceratops. It wouldn't really make sense for Triceratops to be that much faster when trotting. Uh, currently, the trotting is two times faster than the walking. And the running is four and a half times faster than the... Uh, or 4.75 times faster. Sup? 
Emmanuel Barroa, I'm guessing your E man. And then you just press X again, and then you're back to the normal walk. Uh, but let me get in the jungle. The jungle. Uh, there's a, some amber shouts in there. I wonder if they even work. Psycho moment. <laughs> but this trike remodel is really beautiful. Every single dinosaur can trot. Every single dinosaur. Uh, oh, and you can see this is what we changed from last time where your uh, preferred food is yellow. Epic moment. So let me just eat that and I'll show you the uh, max trike uh, stats. I'll, I'll just give myself uh, 100 nutrition because yeah, um, we can't wait for this. So you can see the max stats for the new Triceratops, 1118 HP. This is the absolute maximum you can get without our second new feature, which is mate boosting. Uh, currently Triceratops cannot mate boost because it doesn't have uh, gendered skins. Essentially, if you're in a in a pack, um, let's say you're a Pachyrhinosaurus, you're a male temperate Pachyrhinosaurus, um, and then there's a female temperate Pachyrhinosaurus, and they are both elder. So you're elder, and the other person is, is elder. Then you get mate boosted, and what mate boosting does is basically gives you even stronger stats, as if you're a um, basically a wife and a husband is what we're talking. Mate boost is not because you have mated or something. We're not introducing mate mating to this game because it's against Roblox terms of service, obviously, and it would, it would be ridiculous. Um, um, so basically, if you're an, an elder, you're in the same pack, and you're two different genders of the same dinosaur, then you get mate boost. So mate boost gives more HP, more damage, more stamina, more armor, and more amber multiplier. So mate boosting will be uh, will be quite important if you're trying to raise a baby or something like. But again, it's only for elders, so it's again something to encourage people to elder their dinosaurs. I have actually just eldered my um, my Triceratops on the main game. This is obviously testing, so I can just grow it uh, immediately. But on main game, I have eldered it um, along with some people on the light version of the game today. Um, I'll also show you the attacks. This is the uh, the click attack. Very fast. And this is the second attack. It's a bit more... It's hard to see if you don't know what's going on. Uh, but basically, it's just a he more heavy attack. And then we've got the, um, the third attack here. Which is very fast for some reason. I may need to, uh, to make that a bit slower. Uh, mate boosting lasts as long as you're close to the uh, the other... Dinosaur. And your trike is not fat. Oh, I mean, it is still fat, but it actually looks good now. Like, look at this. It looks beautiful now. We really did Triceratops justice with this model and these animations. Like, finally, it doesn't look like a pee-pee poo-poo head. Like, no offense to Daniel, he, he didn't actually have a reference picture for when he did it. So it was just a bunch of random pictures I chose from Google and told, yo, Daniel, go do this with it. So it was pretty random what he could achieve from it. Oh, there's a Stego. It's Barry. Let's uh, size compare. You can see Trike and Stego. So Trike is a uh, slightly larger. And you can also see I actually buffed uh, Stego's HP from 720 to 800 because we did a bunch of balancing for this update as well. Um, based on a voting we had on the Discord. So everything should be a lot uh, more balanced now, uh, according to what you guys wanted. I am, of course, listening. It's just we can't do a billion different things in one update, you know? It takes time. Uh, everything has to be scripted and everything has to be tested to make sure it works, etc., etc. There's a lot of precautions we have to take when adding new stuff like we got to make sure that people actually want it and it's not just one person in the comment that wanted one person in this chat for example that wanted but you need to make sure that the whole community would like this thing uh, added basically oh god oh. Oh. <laughs> Bro.
Bruh. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Alright. Let's uh, open a testing up for a short while. It's only going to be up for like half an hour or something. So don't expect anything crazy. But I just want to see uh, how laggy people are because we obviously did some optimization things. Bruh. <laughs> so let, I'm just going on studio right now to open up uh, testing. So you guys can join. I already showed the rows. Can just scroll back. But yeah, I'm, I'm opening up testing right now. It just just takes a little while to load in. You can't join just yet. Uh, you'll be able to join in a moment. Look at Trike. Oh, so cool. Look at this. Oh my god. So cool. No. Finally, we have a epic Trike. And basically, we have the whole Ceratopsian lineup fixed now, basically. I think that's pretty cool. Alright, we're in now. Mm -hmm. We disable the auto-kick script. Moment, moment. Oh, a lot of people are trying to join even though it's not open yet. Moment. The Yoshi tricorns. What do you mean? Yeah, I I know, right? I was really cringe back when I did those videos, but now I just do do this like cool gamer stuff. Alrighty. Let me just shut down all servers. So I'ma just leave here. Whoopa. And testing should basically be up now. Let's see if it works. Well, we haven't added X yet, so... Kano doesn't need a remake anytime soon. The next couple of remakes we're doing is like uh, Edmonto changing to Magnapolia, Puru changing to Sako, Serato remake, Megalo remake, stuff like that. Oh yeah, it's open now. Okay, so if you want to join, then I'll, I'll just send a link here on YouTube as well. And let's see how, uh, if people are laggy when they're joining the server. So this is a stress test. This doesn't reflect any gameplay tomorrow in the update, by the way. Like, look at this. It doesn't even load in the whole game for me right now. But it is slowly, slowly loading it in. Let's see. The problem is this server will most likely be filled up to the brim. But I'm not very laggy right now. Please, please tell me if you're lagging when you join. Uh, because we did, we added some stuff that should make it so it isn't as laggy when you join the game. Like you can just see on my screen, I, everything is loading in as I walk around. Yeah, chat may be super laggy. Uh, it, it's a bit laggy when you spawn in at first because it got a, it has to load in the stuff. But once you've been playing for 5 or 10 seconds, it shouldn't be very laggy. That's at least how it works for me. Trike looks good. Let me see here. A lot of errors. Not actually that many. 
Let me see here. Since a lot of people aren't spawned in, there's not a lot of activity here. I mean, I'm not laggy at all. I can definitely tell I'm getting frame drops, but I think I get frame drops like all the time, no matter how many players or whatever. I mean, if you normally play on light, Anyways, I don't think these optimization things we did will change that much. Um, but it should make it less laggy for poor devices. So iPhone 4 players, iPhone 5 players, iPhone 6 players, iPhone 7 players, Motorola players, Android players, etc. It should be less laggy for those people. But I can definitely tell there are some uh, server lag. I mean, I'm not, I'm not experiencing any lag compared to what I normally do. Like this is this is just normal gameplay for me, I guess. If you're lagging every few seconds, then it's most likely because you're loading in some stuff. Warzone, bro. Some people are saying they're not getting any lag, and some people are saying they are. So I assume the ones that they say they are, they just have really bad computers or phones or whatever. And those who say that they are not are probably the ones who normally experience lag, but this is better, I guess. Yeah, but the, I, I'm only interested in if you're getting lag. Uh, or not getting lag, but you normally get lag. That kind of thing. <laughs> no, obviously. Right now, uh, growth is uh, times 10 on this version. So growth is 10 times faster on this version right now. But we are doing a growth event for this update, uh, where growth is 2 times faster. You can see the Triceratops remake fits in perfectly. I don't know what I'm terrain aligning on right here. Oh, it's aligning on the grass. What the heck? Why is it aligning on the grass, I wonder? That's very strange. Usually it doesn't do that. Collision, where are you, Aiden? I mean, I'm not colliding when I just went into that dialo. Yeah, I have no collision lag right now. Um, I may ex have to explain this again so more people uh, realize it. Uh, we fixed collision lag somewhat, um, but it's r it, it works very, very weird. Sometimes there, the collision lag is still there and sometimes it's not. Um, I don't really know how to explain it because I don't know how it works. Uh, but I, I'm getting no collision lag right now, which is great. And I hope that more, uh, most people will not be receiving any collision lag from uh, from playing. Look at all these people playing as the new dialo. The only thing I can see, that guy seems to be getting collision lag. That Rip Jackson guy. You can, you can easily see when people are getting collision lag because they start lagging. They start basically not being able to move as soon as they run into someone. And if the game says uh, gameplay paused, it's because it's loading in the terrain for you. Because your internet connection or PC is quite bad. Uh, it's, a, it's a thing called streaming enabled, which makes it so the whole uh, game is not loaded in immediately when you join. Um, so this will make load in times faster. So you, it doesn't take maybe a minute to load in the game. It takes maybe tw 20 seconds. I don't know. Um, and also makes it so that the general gameplay... I showed this off in a stream, I think, before. Uh, the general gameplay is streamed in. 
So I can only see maybe over to those trees and the rest of the trees are gone, completely gone. But we can't really make it less laggy than what it is on, on this server. Obviously, this server is fully uh, filled up. So don't expect anything crazy on this version of the game. Uh, because there's 40 players right now. And all these 40 players are all grouped up in the same place right now. So you cannot expect there to be great performance right here. Um, obviously, on a, on a light server, it's very uh, very cozy because there's not a lot of PC, uh, a lot of players. And on normal servers... There is not 20 dinosaurs uh, stacked up at planes either, I think. Oh god, something just attacked me. That guy's lagging big time. Oh. Bro, who is this? What? How? How did they just hit that cap, bro? Bro. Trike moment. There is a bit too many dialos here. <laughs> this trike, this trike fits in perfectly. I think this, this is actually a pretty good trike for a default. Let's run away. Looks pretty epic. Trike moment. I can just... I can already imagine people are going to run around and be annoying as shit as Dilophosaur. Like, people are going to be so annoying. They're gonna run around killing babies. Yeah, they're they're just gonna be annoying. <laughs> That's all I can say, I guess. Wait, didn't I just tremble that guy? Wait, what? Can't even see him. The tremble is broken now. What the hell? Bro, tremble broken again. Let me see. There's nothing here. Well, a lot of people will play as Dilophosaurus considering it's going to be a starter dinosaur. So... This is just strange. I usually don't terrain align on the grass. I don't know what's going on. Let me show the rest. I haven't rested yet. So this is the resting animation. Looks pretty nice. Looks chill. Wait, there's no sound. What? Oh, now there is. Just a bit delayed. People seem to be enjoying the Garden Dilophosaurus remake we did. <clears throat> now, Puru is actually going to stay for a little while longer. We'll see when we actually replace it. Trike is slower now than the uh, the old Trike, so... So basically what we're doing, adding in this update, I'll go through the list now. So you can uh, basically get an idea of what we're adding. We're adding the uh, Parasaur Lofus remake that I already uh, did a live stream about. Then we're adding the uh, Dilophosaurus remake, obviously, plus the Garden version. Then this Triceratops remake. Um, then we fixed the, the fall net. Basically, if you fall through the ground, you spawn on top of the world again. Uh, we fixed that on both light and on a uh, main map uh trotting has been added as you obviously saw before uh, we partially fixed collision lag there's been some minor map changes the jungle included in that um we have upped the spawn rates of random corpses around the map uh, mate boost 
heavy optimization boosts. I mean, it seems that people are less laggy for the most part. Obviously, it seems that people are still receiving collision lag. Some some people are. Um, we added some balance changes, a uh, new set of starters. We uh, added the uh, slower drain game pass. That basically makes, makes it so you drain hunger and food slower. It costs uh, 99 Robux, so it's really cheap. Um, then we made it so your combat drains 1.5 times faster if you're in combat. And 1.2 slower, times slower when resting. So I'm resting right now, so my drain should be slower than normal. And then we made the head turning much smoother, as you can see. Uh, instead of just moving one part, it moves all the neck parts, etc. And then what we have yet to do is fix stress, um, fix combat logging, and uh, make mobile able to pick up amber shots. And that's basically what's planned for this update. Sarko remake is not gonna come. Uh, Puru basically remake into Sarko is not gonna come in this update, sadly, um, because uh, it got de kind of delayed. Anyways. I'm surprised. Oh god, there's a lot of Dilophosaurus. Let me just. Now, now I'm trotting as the Triceratops. You can see I'm a bit faster. I can still run, etc. The only thing bad about trotting is that it doesn't regen your stamina. But it doesn't use any stamina either. Uh, so right now, I'm trotting right now. I'm not running. Uh, but you can see my stamina doesn't go up. But then I, I'm walking now. And my stamina goes up, basically. Is there any other dinosaur I could show the... I mean, I could just quickly switch to the garden Dilophosaurus, I guess, and see if I get collision lag and see if uh, I can show off the, the trotting there. Let me just do that. No, the horns uh, do not grow separately from the body currently. Uh, it would be nice if we... Oh god, that was loud. I should probably make Uteranus less loud because yeah, it, it's kind of annoying actually. <laughs> being that loud. Let's see if I uh, get some collision lag now. I probably will because I have really bad luck with that. What? Oh god. What's going on with my frames? I'm getting like 35 FPS right now. Damn, what, what's going on? Somehow it looks smooth on the live stream. But on my on my screen it looks horrible. Like bro, what's going on? I have no idea what's going on. Wait, I didn't even add this to the uh, Roblox yet. Oh what? Come on. What? Did I just die? Bro, what was that lag? Bro, what the hell was that? Like, I couldn't even do anything. Let me try to spawn again. Like, bro, look at this frame rate. It's sh shite. I'm getting 40 FPS. There's definitely something going on here. Are there any arrows? I'm not using that much memory, so it's really strange as well. It's almost just like it refuses to use my GPU. It's also when I'm resting. So it has nothing to do with any sort of collision. I wonder what it is. Let me try normal Dilophosaurus and see if there's a difference. It's really strange.
Like, look, it works just fine in the menu. Okay, so it also happens with this Dilophosaurus. It's very strange. This is definitely something we gotta find out what the heck is going on right here. It seems to be uh, something that keeps on repeating itself, like, because obviously it's not a graphical thing. My frame rate is still horrible if my graphics look like this. So it's definitely a feature of some sort that's checking where everyone else is or something. But it wasn't there for the trike though. Let me see, I switched to Gorgo. And gameplay is mighty fine. I mean, it, the frame rate is still not great, but it's smooth at least. I think it may have something to do with the map. So what if I disable the map? Yeah, I need to find the cause of this because this is real annoying if you're just playing around as a dinosaur and it's laggy as, as heck like that. Bruh. So if I turn the map off, let me just see with another dinosaur. <laughs> With Triceratops, I didn't get any uh, not notably crazy lag. But my frame rate is actually kind of bad. Like, I'm getting less than 60 FPS right here. I do think that there may be something going on. It seems that the more dinosaurs that are spawned in your species. I think it's the mate boosting, actually. Yeah, maybe the mate boosting. Checking if you're elder, if you're this and that. Let me try the Alophosaurus again. How about the Alpine and the, the female version? Come on, let me spawn. The dino is just really laggy for me. Let me try to rejoin the entire game. Damn, that's a there's a lot of people in testing actually. Didn't didn't think there would be this many. Come on, Roblox, come on. Yeah, there's something going on that has nothing to do with the graphics. Let me try and spawn in as the Dilophosaurus again. Yeah, I'm still getting the same frame rate as before. Now I'm actually getting less. Or more, actually. So if I join their pack... Can't, I can only see where that guy is, but that's maybe because he's the only one. Yeah, he's the only one in the pack. But my frame rate is still very bad right now. But when a player is a dinosaur that doesn't, where there isn't any other of the dinosaur species spawned in, it doesn't lag, basically. So I think it's the mate boost thing. We'll maybe do a stress test again tomorrow when we have changed, changed it, I guess. I mean, I, I don't know what else this could be. Like, if I spawn in as Dinosuchus, does it also happen? Come on. Damn, the server is being slow. Like, look at this. I pressed, like, spawn, like, 10 seconds ago. Bruh. My frame rate is also kind of bad here. 40 FPS, that's horrible. There's something going on that's making it really laggy. I 
I have no idea what it is. Could try and join a smaller testing server though. What if I spawn in as a uh, alpha dino? The frame rate is still very bad, but there is a lot of dead dinosaurs here as well because of the growth. Dead arch and how? Like, bro. I'm trying to uh, join the small server and see if the problem is the same there. Let me try to spawn as Dilophosaurus again. Yeah, it seems that the more players that are spawned in, or the more ragdolls, I'm unsure. But I can already see that my frame rate is starting to drop now. More people are spawning in, etc. So there's the, there's something uh, something strange going on. Also, see again, it's colliding with this somehow. Yeah, this is actually pretty annoying that people are, are joining me. Um, but yeah, I think I, I got what I, I needed. There's some strange lag going on. Uh, with that basically makes it makes it lag the more and more. Uh, the more people are playing as the dinosaur you're playing as, which I think it comes from the mate boosting. Uh, I can't see what else we we did that may change stuff um but we'll see we'll see this guy just joined me just to kill me oh my god i'm banning this guy from this version now where is he this guy <laughs> bye 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 <laughs> Stupid, stupid. Sweaty attack helicopter, Beyblade, Levi, Ackerman, Diplo moves. Levi! I mean, my frame rate isn't too bad right now. Um, but we'll see, we'll see. So I'm going uh, to shut down again. <gasps> oh, scary. We got some good stress test from this. I hope that you guys are hyped for the update to be out. It'll be a, a quite epic, I guess. Quite epic. Stand alone will uh, get the same updates, don't worry. Do not fret, it will happen. Just shut it down. Publish to Boblox. Still wondering though, what the heck is going on with that thing? Gonna have to ask Flores tomorrow, I guess. We'll see. Come on, publish. <sighs> Damn. Tired moment. Well, thank you for participating in the uh, the stress test, but I'm uh, I'm shutting down now. So only testers can play again. Sorry, um, but you should have come earlier if you just joined now. Um, bu -bu 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 -bum. Oh god, it got shut down, oh no. 
Oh no, what am I going to do now? Oh god, look, I'm in already again. And looky, looky, look at my frame right now. There we go. My frame rate is much better. Much, much better. Not crazy much better, but it's it's better. It's a bit strange with all this Roblox stuff because it actually isn't using all that much uh, GPU memory or m GPU power actually. It's it's a bit strange. I don't really know what's going on with all this. Uh, and the, the weird thing is it doesn't even want to go even crazier. Like I've set the cap to like 240 FPS right now, but it's only doing 80 or something. Even though my uh, my graphics card is only using twenty eight percent of its power, so it's a bit it's a bit strange. Um, but the gameplay is a lot smoother now, so there's definitely something going on with uh, having a lot of dinos spawned in uh, at the, as the same species. We'll see how we can make that more efficient tomorrow. The update will drop whenever it's ready. I mean, the models are basically ready. Also, I wanted to show you the, uh, the trotting for Dilo. As you can see, it's basically just a sped up walk. It's pretty simple, but it gets the job done. It's faster and it doesn't, doesn't take any stamina, but it doesn't give you any stamina either. But the running is still, it's pretty good. It's pretty good, I'd say. Anyways, I hope that you got uh, some uh, some insider info on what's gonna come in the update tomorrow. Remember, there's coming a two times growth event as well with the update, so you can grow all your stuff to elder, etc., uh, to mature, whatever, two times faster, uh, which is cool. But we'll, we'll see. I don't have anything really to say anymore. So, <sighs> I'm headed out now. Good night, guys. Take care. And uh, spread the word, the update.